trying to put money in your pocket. That crypto wallet. That bing bada bing ching ching big profit. What is going on, believers? Guys, if you followed me for any length of time, you know that there are a few tokens that I hold in the highest regard because of the teams that are behind them. And one of those is this little guy right here. This is Floki. It's not financial advice, but I'm always right. All right, guys, for those of you who don't know, uh, Floki is a token that's been around celebrating a one-year anniversary. And to say that it's gone through a lot is an absolute understatement. And what they did just recently is a review. I look at the first year, and as you can see right here, what lies ahead. And I thought that maybe this would be a good time to reintroduce the people who watch me, the people who might pass through to see what Floki is, uh, what Floki can be, and what this team is going to do to take it there. So let's start off with this. Floki's journey started on the 25th of June of 2021 when creative genius and billionaire Tesla founder Elon Musk tweeted that his Shiba Inu will be named Floki. That tweet inspired the creation of the Floki cryptocurrency by an anonymous developer. Prior to this tweet, both Dogecoin and Shiba Inu cryptocurrencies have proven to be mainstream phenomena, mainly due to Elon Musk's influence and the power of his tweets and memes. Elon is the king of memes, and as he's famously written, who controls the memes controls the universe. Doge and Shiba came from a practical obscurity to both becoming more popular in the world's biggest cryptocurrency, mostly due to the power of memes fueled by the Elon Musk effect. Named after his very Shiba, this effect was bound to transmit to the Floki cryptocurrency, so it wasn't much of a surprise that a community quickly rallied around it. There was a problem, though. Barely a week after the creation of the Floki cryptocurrency, upon realizing that the initial token contract had an inflation bug, the original developer abandoned the project and left it for dead rather than fix things. And what would be the greatest comeback in crypto history, led by the current team, the Floki community came together and ensured a revival of the project to the astonishment of many in the industry who had already declared it dead. At that point, Floki became the people's cryptocurrency, a project that was abandoned and declared dead, came to life because the people came together, bonded, and united in purpose, decided that it had to live. And it lived. And that was exactly one year ago today on July 7 of 2021. While Floki started as a meme coin inspired by an Elon Musk tweet, we've been able to differentiate ourselves and achieve something quite impressive within our first year, becoming a global movement. In Floki's first year, we were able to achieve the following, an all-time high valuation of $3.5 billion. Everyone take a second and just think about that. Floki at one point held a market cap of $3.5 billion dollars, ranking it in the top 100 of all cryptocurrencies in the world. From its relaunch market valuation of $4 million at the time of the revival, despite launching at a time when market sentiments were bearish, a significant development, a significant accomplishment considering many had written the project off. 400,000 plus holders on the Ethereum and Binance smart chain networks. This does not account for holders on centralized exchange like Huobi, gate and over 20 other centralized exchanges where floki has a large user base thanks to this large user base floki has consistently dominated both online and in the real world floki has trended more times and we can count than we can count on top of social networks like twitter stock twits and others we've had periods where floki was trending daily on twitter for two, two straight weeks over 300 people participated in floki's recent event uh, floki ultra's guerrilla marketing competition that's hundreds of people who went out there raiding and evangelizing floki in some form in the real world. Floki's incredible marketing has made it such a force to reckon with, not only in the crypto space, but in the real world. In the span of a year, we've achieved impressive, amazing marketing feats that include partnering with eight major international football clubs, partnering with a major Formula One team, running aggressive marketing campaigns in over a dozen countries, including our widely publicized UK marketing campaign that featured Floki on 300 buses and all over the London underground and that, my friends, <laughs> caused an uproar in the UK. At one point, due to our aggressive marketing campaign, Floki was the most talked about cryptocurrency in the United Kingdom behind only Solana and Bitcoin and ahead of Ethereum and Cardano. Floki's marketing campaigns have put the Floki brand in front of billions of people, many of whom will remember it for years to come 
all within the first year of existence. Beyond Floki's strong community and marketing initiatives is something else that really set us apart and makes us a true movement. A strong focus on charity and a desire to make a true impact in the real world, showing Floki's passion for life uh, for the underprivileged in line with our motto of the people's cryptocurrency. In our first year, Floki was able to complete a state-of-the-art school in Nigeria, pictured here, and commission building of schools in three other nations of the world, namely Laos, Guatemala, and Ghana. Below is a video recording during the construction of the Nigerian school showing how much of a difference the school would make in the community it's being constructed in. Now, uh, guys, I want you to go watch this video, if you will, at your leisure. Uh, this was posted on February 17 of 2022. Uh, we're going to watch it right here and hope that we don't get uh, some kind of strike against us. Uh, it's going to take a moment, but I hope you enjoy it. Furthermore, the school we are building in Laos was recently completed, and below are a few pictures taken of it. Other schools are due to be completed soon. Floki did more than just build schools, though. In our first year, we contributed around $1.7 million to causes focused on fighting food insecurity, such as the Million Garden Movement. Uh, that, by the way, was sponsored by Kimball Musk, an affiliate project, Sweetie Pie. These charitable move, moves are why the Giving Block ranked Floki as the second most charitable NFT project in the world. More importantly, though, they showed that at the heart of the Floki movement is a genuine desire to make the world a better place. In an industry rife with scams and rug pulls, new cryptocurrencies struggle to establish legitimacy. Floki stood out relatively quickly due to strong institutional and utility-focused partnerships, however. We got several institutional and utility-focused partnerships within the first year and made it clear we're playing the long game and that we won't be playing alone. Since institutions only bet on winning horse and horses and after doing their due diligence, these partnerships are essentially a vote of confidence on Floki and our long-term potential. Specifically, some of the top partnerships in the first year are Wintermute, a leading market maker responsible for $8 billion in daily crypto volume. Chainlink, the world's leading Oracle solution responsible for securing $20.5 in smart contracts. Certic, a leading blockchain audit solution partner with the crypto's leading currency brands like Binance, Huobi, etc. Now Payments, Crypto Payments Gateway, and make it pop that make it possible for millions of stores and websites to seamlessly integrate Floki as their preferred payment solution. Floki very quickly differentiated itself from competing cryptocurrencies in its first year through a strong utility focus. Uh, we've been very clear from the get-go that Floki is building an ecosystem. The Floki ecosystem cons consists of Valhalla, a metaverse play-to-earn NFT game, which is our flagship utility product. The University of Floki crypto education platform, 
the Floki Places NFT and Merchandise Marketplace, DeFi through strategic partnership and integration, and the soon-to-be-released Project L, I'm sorry, the Project L Protocol. Beyond outlining these utilities that make up the Floki ecosystem, we've actually proven our ability to deliver. The Battle Arena Tour of Valhalla game launched for the optimistic Kovan testnet late February 2022 to rave reviews. We've introduced several patch updates since and as uh, as well as new Vera showing we are more than capable of delivering something impressive to the crypto community. The University of Floki beta was recently launched and has been well received by the Floki community and key DeFi integrations that show our desire to give people control of their finances. To make it clear, we mean business. As we head into Floki's second year, we recently released our development roadmap for the second half of 2022. Some of the highlights of this are the release of the much-anticipated Gemstones NFTs, the launch of Floki's anticipated Project L protocol, planned DeFi staking and farming, the release of the Floki debit card, initiating the final phase of the transition to full DAO, the first release-worthy version of the Valhalla GameFi Metaverse will go live on Optimistic Testnet. This includes several planned Tier 1 partnership listings already locked down, key partnerships with the most respected bands, respected brands in the industry that we cannot reveal yet due to strict NDAs we've signed and much more. Floki's first year sure has been an exciting one, of which we're thankful for the acknowledge we acknowledge the Vikings that have stood with us without whose support the above accomplishments would not have been possible. More importantly, we're optimistic about Floki's second year. Uh, the second half of 2022 will be packed for Floki and our community of Vikings. And Floki's second year is going to make a huge difference in cementing Floki as a crypto force to reckon with, particularly on a utility and adoption level. Now, let me move on here. Okay, guys, I basically read you the script of what Floki was about. Now, let me give you an outsider's perspective. And full disclosure, at one time, I was a large holder of Floki. And I say at one time because I'm no longer a holder in the token. At its high, my Floki was worth and valued at $37,000. And I sold at $34,000. And there was a very simple reason. Uh, there have been some issues that have gone on in the community and concerns that were raised by the community over time. And those concerns were enough for me to think that the price was going to dip. And I was correct that the price did dip. It dipped drastically. And uh, my intention was, in fact, to take half of that money and then put the other half back into the project, which I have not yet done because uh, as this was going on, the markets were going haywire. And that left everything and everybody in a very peculiar sort of space. So... Uh, there's going to be a time very soon and I don't want to tell anybody because I'm waiting for the right dip that I will be back in and I will be in for a long period of time with Floki. Uh, I don't intend for this to be, uh, this is a transactional thing because I believe that Floki represents, uh, the ability in cryptocurrency to run a project the right way with the right group of people and it will make money to investors. That's the reason that I'm doing it. The reason that you're doing it is your own reason. And if it's just because you want to hold, because you believe in the project, then I respect that. I'm doing it on a transactional basis because I believe that this team from Sabre down uh, are second to none. And they have the best at heart for me and the community and every investor that comes along along the way. So uh, if you think that Floki is the token for you, then you can purchase it. And I will leave the information in the description down below for you to make a decision on whether you would like to purchase Floki and hold it as an investment. But I do believe, if I'm asked my opinion, that Floki is just getting started and that very soon we're going to be talking about Floki. And guys, let me point something out. In a down market like we're in right now, Floki is at 61 million market cap. When the market turns around, Floki will do at least 20x from where it is right now. And then it will only be at one third of its total previous market cap. So I am confident that an investment in Floki is a very solid investment. I'm going to do it 
If you're not with me, that's okay. If you are with me, that's okay too. And if you've been here all along, salute to you. This is not financial advice. My name's Bleeves. I'm always right. And as they used to say, Floki to the moon. Sing it. Oh, 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 oh.